On 20th September, the Catholic Church honors Saints Andrew Kim Taegon, Paul Chong Hasang, and companions. Saint Andrew Kim Taegon is the first native-born Korean priest and is patron saint of Korea. He was martyred with nearly 10,000 other Koreans, mostly lay people, before Christianity was tolerated in Korea in 1884. Today, we venerate nearly 100 of these Koreans who have been declared saints, including Andrew and a layman, Paul Chong Hasang. The first Christians in Korea were baptized by invading Japanese soldiers in the late 1500s. The faith slowly grew and then, in 1777, several Christian texts made their way to Korea and converted some scholars. When a missionary priest visited the country more than a decade later, he found 4,000 Christians living without the sacraments. They had never seen a priest before. The Korean monarchy feared Christianity as a colonizing force and repressed it with several violent persecutions between 1791 and 1866. Andrew's parents were converts to the faith and his father, grandfather and several uncles were executed for it. Andrew's mother was left destitute and had to rely on begging for survival. Andrew was baptized at the age of 15 and soon after left for Macau in China, 1,200 miles away, to enter a seminary there. After further missionary work, he was ordained a priest and returned to Korea to minister and evangelize. Two years later, at the age of 25, he was captured as he made his way along the Korean shoreline to find safe and secret passages for other missionaries. He was tortured and beheaded on September 26, 1846. As a lay leader and married man, Paul was a unifying figure for Christians and advocated for them to the Korean government. When another persecution broke out, he was arrested and tried. He gave a written statement to the judge, who read it and said, You are right in what you have written. But the king forbids this religion. It is your duty to renounce it. Paul replied, I have told you that I am a Christian and will be one until my death. He was tortured, then placed on a cross and died. His mother, Cecilia Yusosa, was also martyred that same year from injuries following repeated whippings. When he visited Korea in 1984, Pope St. John Paul II canonized Saints Andrew Taekwon and Paul Hasang, along with 98 other Koreans and three French missionary priests. Of the group, 47 were lay women and 45 were lay men. Placing all our petitions before these blessed martyrs today, let us pray. O God, who have been pleased to increase your adopted children in all the world, and who made the blood of the martyrs, St. Andrew Kim Taekon and his companions, a most fruitful seed of Christians, grant that we may be defended by their help and profit always from their example. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God for ever and ever. Amen.